Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nancy and I am Stationary Happiness here on YouTube and also on Instagram. Alright, so today I am doing the unboxing of the Planners Anonymous Chapter 4 kits that arrived this week. Now this is the last time that I will be getting this one here which is the Paper Lover Kit. I have been umming and ahhing about how to decrease my costs and I have noticed that I am not using any of the products in this at all. So I thought instead of me keeping it in the cupboard for maybe one day I'll use it, it was time to get rid of it. So what I've done is I've switched up to the planner lover and the sticker lover and that is it. So I'm very happy with my decision. So anyway, let's get started. We'll start with my favourite, which is the Planner Lover, and see what we got this time. Now, this purple, let's talk about that first. I love purple, always have. I think it's absolutely beautiful. And I remember at the very beginning, I was really unsure about these pouches, and I remember saying that I didn't think I'd use them at all. Well, I have been using them. I store my kits in here, and I love them. Okay, so... As you can see we get the sticker pack and we also get the five washies, a sticky notes, a notepad and a journal card with the chapter 4 story on the back. So the story is on the back here and that is exclusive for subscribers so I won't flip that over because Sammy would like that to be exclusive just for the subscribers. So there's our beautiful journal card. Our girl is Betty this time, and I think she looks absolutely beautiful. All right, we also get the washi card, which is fantastic for putting some washies on for on the go in your planner. I haven't used these as yet, but I hope to soon. All right, and then we've got a really cute little sticky notes. I love that we've been getting these each month. I have actually been using these in my planner. I always like to have sticky notes in my planner. So they are adorably cute there. And then you also get the notepad. So it doesn't have any stickiness on it at all. There you go. And we get one of those every month as well. Okay. Next up, we've got our beautiful stickers. I love, love, love the sticker packs now. How amazing are they? So on this side here, you have all your decorative stickers and your functional stickers as well and boxes. And on this side, you have four weekly kits. Okay, so let's have a look at these ones first. Bring them up so you can see. Very calming kit this time, I believe. Just for me, the pinks and the purples makes me feel instantly relaxed. So really really beautiful look at that how cute are the minis i love the ones in the teacup they are so cute and then we've got our word stickers there we go same as every other month by the looks of it and i like these every month we get different um phrases that you can put in your planner and they match towards that month's theme so for example, we've got, uh, this is my dream, I'll decide where it goes from here, um, where the reason there's a girl's trip warning label, and then keep your pinkies high and your standards higher. So very cute. We've got our boxes in different shapes there and sizes. We've got a few rectangles and a few squares. We've got our speech bubbles. Hey! I'm missing one. Oh, what? Okay. Well, it's not the end of the world. It's not stuck on the back. I thought maybe it might have been there, but... Oh, well, that's disappointing. Okay. So I'm missing one sticker. Don't worry, though. You know, I haven't been having much luck with these kits with chapters. Every time I swear there's something missing or not right. But anyway, <laughs> it always gets made but right by Michael and Sammy but this time I'm not going to say anything it's just one sticker so far anyway all right so now we've got our weekly kits so we've got week one with the gorgeous bunnies how cute are they 
I am loving these kits, by the way, because you get the decorative stickers for each week as well. Really, really beautiful. Second week, very high tea theme. I love a high tea. Have not been on one for years, but boy, do I love going on them as a special treat. I feel like the time is now. <laughs> We've got making memories and questionable decisions. That's funny. There we go. Beautiful. My sheets are sticking together a bit. Week four. How beautiful is all this lavender? All right. There we go. So pretty. Okay, so that is our stickers. Now I'm going to quickly take the wrappers off the washi. All right, so here is our five washi tapes. They've been unwrapped. And what I'm going to do is do a very quick swatch of these so that you can see what they look like because I have just been so impressed with the washies in chapters. I mean, I've always liked the washies from Planners Anonymous, let's be honest. But I reckon these have just gone to a whole new level. Does anyone else agree with me? They're just so beautiful. Okay. Oh, wow. Look at the detail in that. That's stunning. That is beautiful. Then we've got our smooshes, as Sammy calls them. Our smooshy paints. I love the smooshes. I found in chapter... Was it chapter... I'm just thinking. Chapter 3. Yes, it was chapter 3. I didn't feel that the smooshes were the same colour as the other washies. And so every time I was putting them in my planner, I was sort of having a colour clash. I don't know if that was just me being unlucky with a bad batch, but I wasn't thrilled about it. But anyway, here we go. Here is our beautiful washi tapes. Oh my gosh, that purple and those pinks, they are just outstandingly beautiful. Wow. Okay, next up, we've got my last ever paper lover kit. Now, I'm just going to open this up. I was actually thinking yesterday how I used to have my ring-bound planners and I used to create new dividers every month and I used to have so much fun doing it. But now that my planning style has completely changed, I just don't have the need to do that anymore and nor do I have the time. So it was time to say goodbye. All right, let's open this up. There we go. All right, so let's start with this pack here. So this looks like our little journal cards. All right, so we've got Catch Feels Not Butterflies. We've got this one here, currently cocooning <laughs> like that. Now, I've got a feeling that's not lavender, and I can't for the life of me think what flower that is, but it's beautiful. Making memories to last a lifetime. This one here reminds me of the butterfly place we went to just outside of Cairns. Beautiful place. Real queens fix each other's crowns without telling the world that it was crooked. Yes. Let's brew this. Absolutely. And that's what I'm trying to teach my girls at the moment. There we go. So there is our really cute journal cards. Okay, next up we've got the stamps for chapter four. There we go. Bit of a glare there, sorry. It's very early in the morning here and the sun is starting to come round to my office and glare in okay let's have a look at this one here so we get another one of these journal cards with the story on there just going to move the papers out the way for a moment just going to leave that in there because we've already seen it okay so with the die cuts i will miss these but i just don't use them anymore so we've got all different types here beautiful 
loving this high tea theme it is so me honestly i wish that i had the money to be able to do a high tea every weekend that'd be so fun <laughs> oh my gosh look at this sammy outdoes herself with the artwork honestly and i say this every time every time i think it can't possibly get any better it does like how does she do it oh beautiful <clears throat> how cute is this rabbit <laughs> hope you can see them all trying to make sure that you can okay so there we go there's all of our gorgeous die cuts and just remember that if you weren't aware these ones are actually sticker die cuts so all you need to do is peel the backing off there and it is already a sticker for you so that is really really handy all right, let's look at the next item. Okay, lastly, we've got the paper pack. And I just realised something. I forgot to tell you at the beginning the name of Chapter 4. Silly me. So it is Butterfly Blooms. I'm so sorry. Gosh, maybe I shouldn't do videos this early in the morning <laughs> on a Sunday. Oh, my gosh. All right, so we'll show the beautiful papers. As always, we have beautiful artwork. Oh, wow. I love this. That's stunning. Wow, 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 wow. Look at that. I'll have to bring it up for you so you can see. Look at that. That is so lovely. I wish you could see it in real life. I mean, it is just beautiful. Okay, and then we've got these beautiful pictures here all intertwined. And that reminds me of the washi, which I'm just grabbing. See? same oh i love that oh i have to use these papers just thinking i can, i have a beautiful purple planner that i think i might put these in wow look at that so beautiful well i can honestly say there wasn't one piece of artwork in this kit that i didn't like and recently I haven't necessarily been able to say that. So we've got the two vellums as well. And then you get the two acetates. So Sammy and Michael listened to the feedback from the subscribers. Because they were only previously putting one of each in the chapters kits. But they have listened and put in the two. Because those of us that used to get the old style kits with the additional paper pack used to end up with two vellum and two acetate. And so a lot of the crafters were missing that. But thankfully, they were very nice about it, listened and added that back for us. So that is fantastic. Alrighty, so there we go. That is the gorgeous Planners Anonymous Chapter 4 Butterfly Blooms Kits. So this was the paper lover and the planner lover. And wow, I mean, Sammy has outdone herself with not only the colours in this kit, but the artwork. It is absolutely stunning. I cannot tell you how much I love it. <laughs> I am so thrilled to have this. So if you enjoyed this unboxing, make sure you give the video a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below what you thought of this kit. I'd love to know your honest thoughts. I always enjoy reading them. And if you're not already, make sure you pop on over to my Instagram page and follow me over there. It is Stationery Happiness. And that's where you'll get to see photos of all of my crafting, planning, happy mail and unboxings. Alright, thank you so much for watching everyone and have a wonderful day. Take care.